Connectors! Welcome to another episode of PsyConnect! I am Teacher CJ, your science teacher for today. Are you now ready to learn? Let us start! In this grade 8 video lesson, we're going to talk about tracking a typhoon. The learning competency is trace the path of typhoons that enter the Philippine area of responsibility using a map and tracking data. Before we start, answer this 5 item quiz. Choose the letter of the best answer and write your answers on your notebook. Let us start! 1. All of the following are the data needed in tracking a typhoon except blank. A. Latitude B. Longitude C. Month D. Second 2. Typhoon Sendong is situated at 30 degrees north, 7 degrees east. It is expected that Sendong is found blank. A. Inside the par B. Outside the par C. Near the Pacific Ocean D. Exactly at the coordinates 3. What is the Philippines National Meteorological Agency that monitors weather occurrences in the country? A. DENR B. DOST C. PAGASA D. FIVOL Which part of the typhoon has a calm condition? A. I B. Eye wall C. Rain band D. Wind system 5. Which statement is incorrect about the importance of tracking the pathway of typhoon? A. People will know how strong or weak a typhoon is. B. People may know the accurate time and date of the arrival of a typhoon. C. Residents in the affected area will be prepared for the coming of typhoon. D. Each family will have enough time to spend for a family bonding before the typhoon arrives. Do this first activity. When to expect. Direction. Using your knowledge and speed, study and complete the missing information in the table below. Then, answer the questions that follow. Write your answers on a separate sheet of paper. Here is Table 1, Theoretical Data of Super Typhoon Rene. You can pause the video if you need more time. Answer the following questions. 1. At what time did Typhoon Rene move fastest? 2. In which date did Typhoon Rene make its first landfall? 3. Why is tracking a tropical cyclone important? Explore. Tracking tropical storms send on. Directions. Plot on the map the location and pathway of tropical storm send on using the latitude and longitude locator in the table below. Here is table number 2, the latitude-longitude location of tropical storm Sendo, with its international name, Washi. You can pause the video if you need more time. Here is the second part. Map of the Philippine Area of Responsibility Questions Where did Tropical Storm Sendong start to form? 2. When did Tropical Storm Sendong enter the park? 3. When did Tropical Storm Sendong leave the park? 4. In what direction did Tropical Storm Sendong move? Keep this in mind. Typhoons have lower air pressure in the middle, but within the eye wall, where dense clouds are found, the wind speed is great. When the eye of typhoon passes over a specific place, it is the winds at the eye wall that brings lots of destruction. 
typhoon tracking and forecasting involve the prediction of the path of a typhoon every 6 to 12 hours over a period of at least 5 days. The weather in a specific location will show signs of an approaching typhoon, like an increase in wave height and frequency, increasing cloudiness, falling air pressure, and heavy rainfall. Reflect Complete the following sentence prompts. I have learned that I wish to ask my teacher about Reinforce what you have learned Answer this next activity. Fill in the blanks with the correct term to complete the statements. Write your answers on your notebook. 1. Tracking the movement of a blank the moment it is formed is very essential because if the track forecast is incorrect, the wind speed, rainfall, and storm surge threats will also be incorrect. 2. Ocean water must reach a minimum temperature of blank in order for a tropical cyclone to develop. 3. A large-scale wind moving in a particular direction over the ocean pushes the tropical cyclones to move in blank direction. 4. When tropical cyclones reach land, they blank because they are cut off from the water supply. 5. In the eye of a tropical cyclone, wind speed is blank. Assess what you have learned. Choose the letter of the best answer and write your answers on your notebook. You can pause the video if you need more time and answer it. Let us start. 1. All of the following are the data needed in tracking a typhoon except blank. 2. Typhoon Sendong is situated at 30 degrees north, 7 degrees east. It is expected that Sendong is found black. 3. What is the Philippines National Meteorological Agency that monitors weather occurrences in the country? 4. Which part of the typhoon has a calm condition? 5. Which statement is incorrect about the importance of tracking the pathway of typhoon? Here are the references. Congratulations learners for finishing the video lesson. I hope you enjoyed learning with me today. Remember, learning is fun with Connect.